Hello children this is your favorite english teacher and in this video you are going to learn some interesting things in block 18 that is where have all the tigers gone The author of this essay is Soumya Rajendran and the aim of the block is to identify the author's purpose for writing a persuasive essay and differentiate between facts and opinions and use helping verbs should must and have to so this is the aim of this essay and you are going to learn some facts and opinions in this essay let's look into the meaning children boar means wild pig endangered means in danger fears with great force or anger predators animals that hunt other animals for food are known as predators the predator which you are going to learn about in this block is tigers next prey animal that is hunted caught and eaten by other animal so these are the meanings in this block the prey animals which we learn in this block are deer and boar and the endangered species in this block is tiger these are the meanings in this block here here is an interesting topic facts and opinions so children facts are something which is true and acceptable for example russia is the largest country in the world coming to opinions opinions are beliefs of someone for example english is the easiest language of all so these are facts and opinions now let's look into the essay children this is a persuasive essay where have all the tigers gone is a persuasive essay the author of this essay is soumya rajendran the author wants to persuade us that tigers are endangered species which means tigers are few and tigers are disappearing for two reasons they are hunt for their skin and bones and forests were destroyed to grow crops so these are the reasons why tigers have become endangered so people hunt tigers for their skin and bones so tigers are predators deer and boar are their prey so children so the author's opinion is if tigers disappear deer would increase and slowly jungles also disappear if jungles disappear we too would disappear soon because without jungles we won't get proper rains and without rain we cannot grow the crops so we must remember to save tigers and we must also remember that we are the part of this earth because everything in nature is connected and our planet earth is shared by many animals birds and insects so everything in nature is connected and we should remember that we must save tigers so let us see some facts and opinions in this essay children the tigers are predators deer are prey these are facts and coming to opinion we should learn to share our planet here is the last topic in this block that is helping verbs so these are the three helping verbs that you are going to learn now must should and have to the helping verbs must and have to are used to advise strongly 
okay so these words generally are used to make an order or a thing that one must follow for example we must save the tigers coming to the word should it shows that we use this word to suggest something or advise someone 